Glasgow City Vision, I chose to run the Ladies 10K. I felt it was a really worthwhile thing to do. It was, it was really enjoyable for the Glasgow City Mission. I chose to run the Great Scottish Run, which is a half marathon. So, yeah, it was good. Well, I actually took part in the spin fit for the Glasgow City Mission and the reason I'd done it was because I've volunteered for the last year and I've seen what the mission can do and for the facilities that they actually help with for people from during the day like your literacy classes to the night time to serving food out to the various um, types of people that use the facility. I felt quite passionate about it so I just wanted to make sure that it keeps going. Um, I chose to support Glasgow City Mission because I am increasingly aware that with a bed and food to eat, just how much we've got and how privileged and fortunate we are. I would definitely do it again, I'll probably run again this year as well, um, but I feel that the fundraising side of it went really well. Um, people were really keen to find out who the Glasgow City Mission was, a lot of people hadn't heard about it. Um, and as soon as people found out there was something on our doorsteps here in Glasgow, they were so keen to support and help. Um, I was absolutely blown over with the amount of support that I actually got when I told them about the cause. It was really good. The best thing is, is to get as many people that you know, whether it's friends or family or colleagues, um, because I work over in this building and basically I managed to get another 18 people to come and join me so it meant the more people that came the more we got to fundraise even if it was a basic entry £10 to having a sponsorship and people were actually raising up to like £50-£100 and it all raised up to quite a good a substantial amount. If they feel that there's something that they could do and they would like to do it, I would maybe advise them to go along, have a look at what actually happens, get an inside knowledge themselves so that they can then fundraise properly with the knowledge and be able to pass that information on to other people. People are keen to know why you're fundraising, they want to know where their money's going and I think it's important that if you're, you're going to do that that you need to know exactly what it is you're asking people for money for and people will bend over backwards because it's for Glasgow, most importantly. I would say to them, go for it. Um, I went very much with the element of surprise. I think most people wouldn't ever expect me to run a half marathon. I normally wouldn't run unless I was being chased. So um, uh, I bombarded people with Facebook and texts and generally just hassled them into giving me money. Um, and folk in general were very, were very supportive and very encouraging.